Hey everybody, we're Keenum Handicapping Harness Racing from the Cathedral of Mecca of Harness Racing in North America, the Big M, the Meadowlands in East Rutherford, New Jersey on Friday, February the 10th. And this is my dayatthetrack.com Harness Race of the Day. Let's take a look at Race 2 this evening, folks. 7.20 p.m. Eastern Post Time. This is the second leg of the Cape and Cutter Stakes. We have mares racing for a purse of some $35,000. Contenders number three, higher and higher. The paired entry of number one, a modern connection, and the stable mate number one, rock and soul, make my contenders list, along with number five, symphony in motion, and number two, oceans motions. Number three, higher and higher, is both the overall speed and class profile leader in this stakes field this evening. Comes off back to back to back power run wins in her last three starts. This entry has won an impressive $79,500 in her last six outings, which is easily the top earnings total in this field tonight. Number 1A, Modern Connection and her stablemate, number 1, Rock and Soul, have similar records, both posting power run wins in their respective second races back and power run show results in their respective third races back. Race 2 summary, number 3 higher and higher tops my contenders list tonight, which also includes number 1A Modern Connection and the Stablemate, number 1 Rock and Soul, also making my list number 5 Symphony in Motion and number 2 Oceans Motions, 3-1-5-2 in the second from the Meadowlands, the $35,000 Cape and Cutter Stakes. Bonus long shots, race 1, entry number 5, Dooley. 8 to 1 in the morning line qualifies as a Trackmaster Plus Power Pony's recent past performance sheet show a power run win in his third race back in race three tonight here at the Big M, the six to one shot. Number five, Master Bagona, class profile leader in this trotting field this evening, has hit the board in power run fashion in each of his last three starts. So from the Meadowlands on a Friday night, Rick Needham for day at the track.com reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over it.